to deal between my boyfriend and his niece. Stay until the end because I have two updates and two comments. So, my boyfriend doesn't have kids of his own, but he has two nieces and one nephew. They all live in his parents' house, and their mom, my boyfriend's sister, lives there too. The kid's dad is not around. One niece is 19, and the nephew is 15. They do their own things most of the time, but the other niece, who is 18, is around a lot. It's okay because we're friends. But she asks my boyfriend for a lot of things, she asks for money, and sometimes she asks me for things too. She also asks my boyfriend for rides and always wants to know when he's coming home. She calls him a lot, even when he's with me. At first, it bothered me. But I got used to it. The problem is, lately, I feel like she's going too far. Two times when we were having a special night, she called crying, and we had to stop everything to help her. She even came back to my place with us, so our special night didn't happen. On Friday night, my boyfriend was staying over and we went to the store to get whiskey. He left his phone at my place, and on our way back, I got a text from niece to asking why her uncle wasn't answering. It's the third time she asked me that. It was really annoying, and I'm not sure if I'm getting too upset about it. Update number one. I wrote all this because I felt like it, and I want to say that she sometimes feels really sad and hurts herself. She's like the odd one out in her family, and her parents treat her differently than her siblings. I like my boyfriend's parents, but they treat her brothers and sisters better. She doesn't get along well with her mom, and she has trouble with friends sometimes, she also has boyfriends, but, me and her are good friends, except for when she crosses some lines. I'm okay with hearing what you think and any advice you have. Update number 2. Right after I wrote this, she called him, and was crying a lot we call it, ugly crying even though she's not ugly. We went to get her from work, like, for hours early, when we picked her up. She seemed okay and was talking a lot, which was totally different from how she sounded just 20 minutes before. I'm kind of confused because I don't know if she's really upset or if she's doing it to get attention. Thank you for all your advice. And my boyfriend and I will talk about what to do next sometime this week. Comment number one. I guess part of the niece's feelings might be about being scared of losing a dad again. Even if her first dad was never really there, she might have figured out that she didn't have a real dad. And now, it might feel like her stand in dad is moving away from her. Comment number two. It seems like your boyfriend has become kind of like a dad to his niece. And he's chosen to be there for her and take care of her. That's really nice and loving of him. You mentioned that she interrupted your special night. But maybe she didn't know you had plans, even if she did. It might have been hard for her to see her uncle paying attention to someone new, like you. She might be feeling a bit worried or insecure. Or maybe she's having a tough time with her mom. It's a tricky situation. She needs better help and guidance from her mom to grow up and understand things better. Luckily, your boyfriend is still helping and taking care of her. But I get that it's tough when he puts her first sometimes if her mom doesn't step up and she doesn't have good role models, and your boyfriend cares enough for her. It might be up to you two to help her grow up and learn about boundaries. She's still a teenager and might not know everything yet. It could take a few years. But teaching her about boundaries and helping her understand that when she lets her uncle spend time with you, he's not going to disappear, could be a good starting point. 